What's up guys, I'm back with another movie review. Today I've got one from Wild Eye Movies, and this is pretty much exactly what I think of when I think of Wild Eye Movies, is something like the Jurassic Dead, aka Zombiesaurus, aka Z-Rex. Uh, just ridiculous concept, really awesome, splashy cover art. So this movie is about a scientist who comes up with a formula that can be used to bring dead things back to life. Um, it's decided that it's just not a, you know, not something that it's not a road that we should be going down essentially and uh you know he's not happy about it so he decides to use the serum on a dinosaur <laughs> which who knows how he i don't know how he got the dinosaur or whatever but he ends up having a zombie t-rex it goes crazy starts biting people and then the movie kind of flashes forward to um a few different groups of people who end up converging at a like hidden underground bunker and from there things just spiral into like a ridiculous uh i don't even know how to explain it it's just stuff happens and that's the movie um, i don't know any other better way to put it you know you have all these people down in the bunker and they're trying some of them are trying to get rid of the serum uh then you have the people who want to protect the serum then you just have kind of goofballs that are caught in the middle of it and that's pretty much the movie sorry i can't be more specific on what exactly the point of it is um this is a really cool movie and i want to say right off the top when you see a cover like this, we have all been on this road. We've been in a video store, and you see an awesome cover like that, and you're like, dude, zombie T-Rex, I want to see this movie. You get it home, you put it in, and whatever's on the cover is not in the movie, or it's only in there for a few seconds. Let me dispel that right now. This movie does have a zombie T-Rex, and it is featured prominently in the movie. It's not in all the time, but it is definitely there. Uh, it gets a lot more screen time than I expected, and it looks really cool. I was pretty surprised uh, how good the effects were in this movie. Uh, some of the CGI doesn't look good, but there's also a big like practical uh, T-Rex that looks really cool. So if you're here for the zombie T-Rex, this movie delivers. Otherwise, it has kind of like a horror sci-fi vibe as the people try to survive. Uh, you know, these zombie creations and each other in the bunker. It's a, just a really fun, brisk movie. It's Is it dumb? Yeah, kind of. But it's also really fun. It's cheesy. It's got some good gore in it. It's got some really cheesy, over-the-top dialogue. It's got colorful characters. And essentially, in a movie, I think, anyway, like The Jurassic Dead, that's what you want. You want a movie that's colorful and fun and, you know, just goofy. And that's exactly what this movie is. I don't know how it could have been much better other than just to have, like, you know some cheesy uh washed up b movie star maybe pop up for a cameo or something but honestly i thought this was this movie was pretty good for what it was uh the dvd from wild eye looks fine it's a dvd it's not a blu-ray so it doesn't look you know sparkling and you know super refined but it looks really good i had no issues whatsoever which is good because this movie has some cool visuals and especially being able to soak in all the effects you want it to look you know nice and clear and clean and that's definitely the case here um, unfortunately, there's not a lot of extras if you're interested in that kind of thing. There's some Wild Eye trailers, and that's about it. Uh, so in the end, I know a lot of people are probably going to pass it by because they're going to be like, there's no way this low-budget B-movie is actually going to have a zombie T-Rex. And if it does, it's going to be really shitty CGI and appear for like two seconds. That is not the case, man. This movie is has an awesome-looking dinosaur, and you get to see it do a bunch of stuff. And you get to see some cool gore and some funny dialogue. I just thought it was a really good time. Uh, that's my review of the Jurassic Dead, which, as I said, is also known as Zombiesaurus and Z-Rex in some releases. But when Wild Eye put it out, it was the Jurassic Dead. Uh, if you want to read my full write-up, you can go to markfusion.com and check that out. There's also a ton of Wild Eye movies there, as well as a ton of other independent B-movie, uh, you know, horror and sci-fi whatnot there you can also follow me on instagram twitter and twitch if you want to see what i'm doing at any of those places you can go to letterboxd and follow me there at mark fusion if you want to get an idea of what might be coming up onto the channel soon because i watch a lot more than i'm able to review here uh, so it takes me a while to get caught up uh, but the best way you can help me out is just to hit that sub button it's a free easy direct way to support me help me to keep making these videos watching all these crazy zombie dinosaur movies so I'd greatly appreciate that. Also, watching old videos is a huge help. Uh, so if there's something that catches your eye, definitely you know check that out if you're interested. There's a ton of uh, cheesy B-horror movies, tons of wild eye movies, uh, genre films, all kinds of lifetime movies, all kinds of stuff. So thank you so much for watching this video, though. I do sincerely appreciate it. Hopefully I'll see you guys soon.